What is going on YouTube? It's Wilson back with another episode of Fallout. Thank you guys for the crazy support on the first episode. Did not expect it, so I really appreciate it. If you did miss that episode, you could check it out on the channel. Going by EJ, he has seen the entirety of the show. I have not. Obviously, it's my first time watching. Do enjoy the video. You want to stick around for all the other awesome shows and movies we're going to be covering in the future and already covering. Drop a like, hit that sub button. We really appreciate it. Drop a comment. Let me know your favorite part of the episode. Let's get into it. I don't know what to say. So good. Kill this fucking guy. That's what I have to say. Murder all of these people. No remorse. But I know that someday that sun is bound to shine. What's that? God. Oh. oh don't lick me with the blood uh so is he like not allowed to have the dog or is he still yeah, working he's... like i was keeping him in the hole in the wall yeah please remain calm <laughs> how am i supposed to Oh, cool. No wonder, you, no wonder you can remain <laughs> calm. That thing's not going to hit you. <laughs> I know. <laughs> what the hell? That was <laughs> some opening. Jesus Christ. Oh, Burn those Jesus puppies. I know. The old playlist is amazing. Yeah, I'm like bobbing my head along. <laughs> Oh, I don't even notice the baby. Yikes. Tank. Boys? Poison, yeah. Figured they'd rather go out like that. Oh, old POV. <laughs> Ah, oh, you creep. Then you will have to adapt. The question is, will you still want the same things when you have become a different animal altogether? Just gonna leave. Are you? <laughs> this weird old man just get the glowing shit in his neck, man. Let's impart this weird ass advice and <laughs> disappear into the shadows. Back to clean and shit. Set us down. I'm bored and I want to shoot something. Oh, my lord, <laughs> we were so I'd feel pretty safe with this dude, probably. Yeah. But this is a dumb way to get killed. You're not yeah. even going where you're supposed to go. Cram. Ugh. Oh dear. Oh. What the f what the hell's in there? Yeah, he looked terrified. Oh, same spot. I want him to snag this armor. Well, Titus eats it. What's the problem, dipshit? <laughs> oh. Is that a radioactive rat? Bear? <laughs> Shot. He was gonna let that thing eat him, I think. Give me a step back! You stupid motherfucker, you know this is all your fault. Oh, you're done, buddy. I'd let him go. 
You know what they do to squatters that don't do their fucking job? They string you up, Maximus, by your uh, lungs, and they uh, they hang you. Wrong and let time the to be telling come about get you. It is a knight's duty <coughs> to better this fallen world. You don't deserve that armor. He's gonna let him just go. Dude, he's cold. Yeah, man. He definitely put that razor in that shoe. 100%. He does what it takes. What's that you're working on? It's meant to be a water filter. No matter how much sand I put in it, I just get more sand. Well, <laughs> have you tried water for the water filter? You got water? <laughs> uh, uh, sorry. Uh, sir, I actually, I might... I need that. Yeah, me too. Thank you. <laughs> My hand you a bottle of clean water and you drink it. Even if you're not thirsty, you drink it. <laughs> it's one of them rules, one of them things you gotta learn up here. <laughs> like, yeah. People get killed in Philly all the time. That's where my daddy got killed anyway. A couple brothers too. Had a hand as well. She got <laughs> killed there once. Jeez. She got killed there once. Once. I hear that. Sounds dangerous. Or you just stay here. Live with me. <laughs> Use the family and help with all the work. Tempting, okay, very but, uh... tempting. I'm real sick. Make him die and well, you wouldn't have to put up with me for too long. <laughs> this could all be yours. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> that guy's funny. Yeah. Oh shit. That's fucking cool. You like the Tony Stark helmet shot? Watch out. Yeah, Jarvis. Hello, sir. <laughs> As for you, you stupid Rube, not the first time I've been persecuted for my scientific curiosity. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay? Don't, don't murder me. It's just, the guy was fucking my chickens. <laughs> fucking my chickens. <laughs> I was thinking like maybe my my scientific curiosity. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Dog meat. Oh, it's with dogs in this episode, man. God, it's pretty sweet. Yeah, I love the set design and all that stuff. This this really gave me video game vibe, you know, like yeah, I could see that. The way you walk through the tunnel, you see the whole new like place you're at. Ugh, mediation, crazy. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh, you see her. Ma'am, the radar I'm looking for is about five foot nine. Barb. A woman in her fifties, I think. Barb. Goes by the name of Barb. Moldaver. Get in here, you... I take it you know who she is. Everyone knows who Moldaver is. So she said everyone knows yeah. who I am. Well, you see, the idea is we're going to save America. And when exactly were you planning on saving America? The vaults were nothing more than a hole in the ground for rich folks to hide in while the rest of the world burned. Interesting. Thank you for your help, ma'am. You're so nice. Tell us how you really feel, lady. Damn. The double-headed cow. 
Oh, they're all here, baby. You come from Vault 33. Your primary crop is corn. You have a telesonic projector in your farm. It lives images of the Nebraskan countryside. Who are you? And how do you know so much? Hey! Real zig! Get. You know your kind ain't welcome here. Well, maybe not. But I'm gonna make myself welcome. Lucy really got caught I in the middle of this. <laughs> but I've been paid a whole lot of caps to provide this man safe transport out of Philly. Oh! oh, that dog's gonna go crazy. He's so cool. Fuck. <laughs> oh my god. Like the Come whole on. size of that. Like. Oh! I love the noise that thing makes. Light off you one of these cherry tomatoes, but you got a hole in your neck. <laughs> Just ate those bullets, no problem. It's a great shot. <laughs> Shit. I love his coat. It's like a ghouly, ghosty kind of thing. Oh no. Oh. I didn't like that. I know. I think everyone in this town would agree the force is justified. Unless you willingly stand down now. Well, now that is a very small drop in a very, very large bucket of drugs. <laughs> she said stand down. Oh, shit. He can fly, as I thought. Oh, damn. You gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> oh, no. Ah! Go, 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 go. Ugh. Ah. Oh. I the You keep moving things around without telling me. I don't mean to interrupt, but was that a knight? <laughs> Her knight in shining <laughs> armor. It's come to save her. goes by the name of Lee Moldaver. Oh, damn. Exactly where she needs to go. You ain't getting near Moldaver without something to bargain with. And delivering this guy right here is your best option. Well, what does Moldaver want with you? I mean, she steals dads. <laughs> <laughs> Just tossing him around. Shit. Well, I guess basic training ain't what it used to be. You drive that thing like a fucking shopping cart. <laughs> Rule number one. Read the manual. Here's the lasso. Jesus, Maximus! Oh no! Invigorate! Chicken fucker! Oh! <laughs> Not uh, 
not ideal first rodeo in the suit. But I mean, I'm not surprised. Like you said, read the mail. Like, yeah. I don't know. I'm just, like, I know he's like good with it, I guess. But basic training is training. Like being out there is different. You fucking dude. Get the dog, get the dog to sniff him out. It's not a bad call. Good as new. Yep. Oh, thank God. Russian. Satellite? Satellite. Yeah. This place is wild. Just like, you know, caught up. Just like lose your head for a second and you're, uh, You'd be in some deep shit. I'd, I'd be wanting to go back to that Here that we vault. Have about Twenty miles yeah. left to go. How's your new? Oh, oh golly. Oh. Uh. I'm not going to make it. I don't know who you are or how you know the things that you do, but you are going to get across that wasteland, and we're going to do it together. No, you see, I've just taken a cyanide pill. <laughs> Oh, shit. You can change the future if you can bring me to Moldava. But how am I gonna bring you if you're... you know, not, not my whole body, just my head. Yeah, pardon? Yeah, par yeah, pardon? Oh, you just have this? I took the pill so that it would be less taxing for you to go through with it. It would be easier if you <laughs> carry my head instead of dragging. said, lose your head for a second. Jeez, man. Don't lose your head. <laughs> you need to start acting like a surface dweller. <laughs> okay, Miss McLean. How do you know my name? Uh, what? did know quite a bit about her bunker. Yeah, he knew a lot, but I figured he's like a scientist. Maybe he's privy to that kind of stuff, but sort of that chip in his dome is. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Okay. Jeez. Yeah. That, the show is on the road. The show is like. It's humor. It's just like. It's not like. It just like hits. Like. I don't know how you explain it. It's, like, it's very like slapstick. Like. Yeah. Yeah. Just. It'll be easier if you just cut off my head. It'll be easier for you. You know. <laughs> yeah. Less. You know. Yeah. Or like. You didn't, you didn't read the manual. <laughs> yeah, you gotta read the manual. That guy, like, yeah. my my aunt died once there too. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's it's really funny. Um, I could use a family to you know help with the workload. Yeah, I think I'm done. Put up with <laughs> yeah. me for too long. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's it's yeah. It's very like when I first watched it, I was surprised like how different it felt than a lot of. It does feel movies. different and unique. Sure. Yeah, very cool vibe to it. I think everything that goes into it, like the the way that the, the actors portray like this dystopian future, and then the the soundtrack, and it's all it all works so well, it's so good. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, yeah, I love the sets too, like the the whole town and like trash and just junk and shit, and yeah, uh, it looks great. Um, yeah, it's getting, it, a lot getting of... into specific. I mean, we start out with burning puppies and dude, that yeah, came. That's what I mean. Like yeah. it just kind of hits. You. Like I was yeah. like, I went from all to oh, like in the same like second. Yeah. <laughs> because of, oh, it's just out of nowhere, they're experimenting, training these dogs. So yeah, he, he so he's keeping the dog in the wall. He's not supposed to be doing that. Yeah, I was at first. I was like, fuck, fuck this guy. Yeah, but he seems yeah. like a nice, like he seems like a nice guy. Mm -hmm. He doesn't seem like an evil scientist. Yeah, 
you know, he's trying to like look out for her and impart some advice on her and things like that and knows her. So I yeah. don't know and the vault, like you said, so I don't know like Yeah, he tried helping her out, like he was he seemed like a good guy. Yeah, I'm just curious how he knows who he is. Mm -hmm. Uh he said his name was like Wilsey, something like that. Are you curious escape from the enclave? Like what's the enclave? Uh like where he was coming from. It's a chip in his neck. Yeah. A lot of questions. Why do people want him so bad? Yeah, yeah and then um and then shoot out with the ghoul is really cool. Yeah. Very nice. And then like going back to the how he even got the armor in the first place to man, that, <laughs> that dude man sucked in there, man. That dude I know, sucked. Dude. Rappaport. Michael Rappaport was who that was. Oh, I, um, I recognized him. Yeah, he's in some stuff. But, uh, yeah, like, he was being such an ass. Like, dude, you, first off, you dropped, like, miles early. You could have dropped right into Philly. Um, uh -huh. it, there's so many things that, that he did. He wanted to shoot something, runs in there, makes him go in, and then the, the man bear pig is behind him. Doesn't shoot him. <laughs> yeah. Like he fail yeah, fails to shoot him or tries, he like yeah, he like blows at the gun. <laughs> yeah. And it's like you gotta you got a med pack and you're literally talking to the shit to the guy who can save your life. Like, yeah. Horrible decision. I don't blame Maximus, but I like I like that he's not all like knight in shining armor, like good guy kind of thing. Yeah. I feel like there's yeah. like a darkness in him for sure, like Mm -hmm. Just kind of watching him die, like letting this guy die, and then I, I truly think he, truly think he, he put the razor in the shoe. Yeah, he's kind of giving me like, pe like peacemaker vibes in the sense that like, I want to keep the peace, you know, justice. He wants to do the right thing, but he do the right thing, but I'll do the wrong, wrong thing. thing to get yeah. there. Yeah, which is interesting. I'd, I'd prefer that over, you know, Mister Goody Two Shoes, Captain America type of thing. And then, but with, in this type of show too. Yeah, definitely. You already well, got her, who's like the super. She, good. yeah, she's the goody two shoes, and she's got to kind of break that a little bit to to survive. But she's really like, she's really endearing. Like how it is since she is, and she's just trying to like be nice. <laughs> yeah, literally just trying to be nice to everybody. And it's interesting. Like I didn't, I didn't know we got a little kind of perspective on the vaults on the outside, like their perception of. Uh, the vaults and it was like for rich people you know uh and every, all the other you know lesser privileged people burned pretty much uh which is yeah. interesting uh yeah, kind of, kind of makes sorry i was gonna say like the resentment kind of makes sense i guess yeah and especially when i liked how they like had her perspective of it like saying well i mean we're gonna save america and she's just like what did you plan on doing yeah, that like well, the world yeah. the world's been going on like yeah is, exactly things been going on so what when it when is this master plan supposed to happen like yeah I, so I, I like that little exchange between them but overall it's like it's it's great man right the actors the story so far like everything yeah story. i have no no complaints at all everything's good right? I love I love just watching Goggins do his thing, man. Oh man, he's like having so you can tell he's having so much fun. Like, <laughs> yeah, he was he was so badass in the in those scenes at the uh, in Philly. Um, that thing like a shopping cart. Yeah, he's like, <laughs> which makes it because he was in the military, right? So yeah. back in the day, it's like basic training must change. You know, like, <laughs> no, it's funny. I'm curious. I want to know more about him. I, yeah, learning more of his backstory. Yeah, like how he got to being the ghoul and shit. Oh, how about uh, we didn't touch on this. Uh, Maximus, when he first gets in the suit, he's testing it out, and all of a sudden he comes across Mr. Chicken Fucker. Mr. Chicken Fucker. I was <laughs> thinking like, oh, is he stopping the the good guy? You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Like, and then the bad guy's getting away, but he's like, he's fucking with chickens. <laughs> <laughs> It's not the first time I've been persecuted for my scientific curiosity. <laughs> uh, yeah, then we see him again. He's offering him to grow him a foot. Yeah, like, just bullshit. Like, yeah. oh, we can grow a whole new foot. <laughs> oh, how convenient! Yeah. It's very video. It's very video game. I definitely felt this episode like it was very 
yeah more, much one. more like a video game app adaptation like as opposed to the first one it literally just felt like the first mission you're getting you're getting to your first yeah city, you, yeah like, you get first city new area meet new character go to the shop you know what i mean like, like get, make sure he escapes philly like it's, yeah take this mission. guy here your coordinates look at the map type of thing like yeah but it, like it was done in such a good way that it it's it's so it felt natural I it. yeah I love it Love it, love it, love it. It was really cool. Yeah, I, I, I loved it. I'm really into it. I, I, I'm curious now, like, where the story goes. And how Maximus comes back into the fold. The ghoul obviously smartly took, you know, kind of stimmed the dog. And that dog's obviously going to lead him right back to at least that satellite now, um, probably. So we'll see where he goes from there. But excited for the next one.